Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks at Showstopper CES 2015. In this video, it's powered by ASUS. In my hot little hands, I have a 12.5 inch Ultrabook. Love to see this form factor come back. This is the Folio 1020. So we're gonna take a quick walk around the system before I open it up to show you the display. We have a micro SD card slot. There's USB 2.0 and that is charged so you can power your devices when it's off. Full size HDMI, Kensington lock. Around the back you can see the lovely Hewlett Packard little logo. And you'll notice there are no fans, so this is a Core M processor. Around the other side we have the PSU, there is the um, HP dock, so that, that you know docking station with USB 3 and full size ports for all your docking needs. And if you have a home desk, um, that's kind of the point. Another USB 2.0, and then there we have a headphone jack. So let's open this up. You can see that it has like an aluminum chassis. There is actually two models of this. One of them, this one here is 2.68 uh, kilo pounds. <laughs> and uh, the 2.2 is actually with a magnesium alloy, so it shaves off some weight. Let's open this up. It feels very sturdy in hand. And then there, let's just turn it on. Okay. Oh, oh sorry about that. There we go. Backlit keyboard, touch screen. Uh, you see how small we made the text in here? This is a QHD display. Totally digging it. Really nice. Uh, viewing angles, very crisp colors. Uh, a Core M, I'm not so excited to be seeing QHD displays, but it is not like the crazy high QHD display. It's 2560 by 1440. And if we can do a couple other things in here. Oops, I'm locking the bar. Things are too small for me to be touching. Yeah, so we can see it's really nice great display. Let's just flip this around a little bit. Uh, let's go over some other specifications. We've got 8 gigabytes of RAM, 128, 180, and uh, 256 of storage on an SSD. You can see here on the keyboard that we have a fingerprint sensor just down around the side. And the touchpad is a clickless touchpad uh, where you can kind of zoom around. You can't click on anything, which is, I don't know, I, I feel that's a little bit weird. Oh, and look over here, I have a version that is lighter. This is the 2.2 pound one. It is so much, wow, it is light. With a nice little red stripe there down the side. I'm kind of digging what I'm feeling here with the Elite Book. Uh, the, the price isn't overly cheap. We're looking at uh, $11.50 for the full HD version. Uh, obviously not with this aluminum or magnesium chassis, but totally digging how much better this feels in hand, actually. Yeah. So Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks, just checking out a nice 12.5 inch mobile computer that you can bring around with you that's not too big. Don't be buying 15 inch laptops, they're just not portable. Go with something like this. Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks, let's see us 2015.